Alright, so I don't usually do these kinds of videos, but I had the perfect idea when I was in the gym today. You know what? Might as well uh, record this because uh, maybe it's time to step out of the comfort zone a little bit and do something other than uh, videos that have completely no context towards them. So I got my protein shake here today and. Uh, I guess we're going to be switching it up with sort of a let's play. I don't know. I'm going to try. Apologies if the editing isn't up to par. Uh, but I guess we'll, we all have to learn somehow, right? All right, let's get it. I think this is about the most difficult choice in gaming history, is choosing your difficulty. Right, let's try... Let's try default. If it gets uh, too easy, but I guess we'll just do it again. All right. Silence, you children of gods, and heed my tale of time's beginning. dark. There was no sand. There was no sea. No earth. Nor sky. No grass. Nor wind. Till fire met ice in the gasping void. And from this green came the giant Ymir, first of all beings. Proud Ymir, cruelly killed. Yet from whose bones and blood and brains the world was made. The world you walk and war upon. All right. Well, uh, that intro was pretty cool. <laughs> I mean, oh, okay. Hey, what? Here's a tune for you. Want to liven your step? My sword is called greedy. I'm ready to fight. So nice heavy Now this is pure manipulation of a uh, how old am I? Seven? Eight? Using me as like bait to bring unity between two clans. Oh, no drink in your fist? Come on, I'll find you something. I have accepted you for your father. Oh, what a piece! That must be worth two sturdy longships. 
Give it here. I'll pass it on. My father asked me, Seeger. Suit yourself. No, thank you, You're thief. You're not getting any meat. Oh, damn. That's a real, real shame. works through my hammer. <laughs> when you speak with the king, hold it up to the light. Show him the fine details. See there? I etched his name in runes on the outer band. You'll show him? Mm -hmm. You are just like your father, little berserker. Skull to you. Skull! You this see? is such yeah, a cock block. Calls me a berserker. Like, dude, I just want to murder people. I mean, if I have to do it as a seven-year-old boy, I will. But, you know. I just want to be... I want to be in the action already. Not being a, a ring bearer. Like... Uh. Not trying to marry someone off. So, you have the ring? Good. This was worn by your grandfather in a battle on the northern way. Mother? Yes. Can we show Sigurd the can stones he stacked yesterday? That's a good idea. We'll do that in the morning. First light. <laughs> <laughs> Was that a person? Now go. You have a gift to deliver. Mm, I know. Let me go. God damn. All this chit chat. Just want to get to it. Abel, wait. forever I am pledged to you <laughs> now's the time to strike fucking hidden blade his ass go do it come on all of kings ah an ocean steed my words gain wings oh then speed our fourth will bring a noble deeds that are the same <sighs> Thought I was gonna kill people and it's just medieval high school musical. Oh, oh goodness. Oh. Oh great, here we go. Here's this is another one of those games where I witness my per parents' death and then I seek out the killer the whole game and then get cock blocked by DLC. Nothing is true until it is severed from the branches of Am I supposed to just like go out there? I mean Ooh! Ooh! Oh, she's got aimbot for sure. Oh my god. I'm pretty sure that's my mother. And I've, I've never... I've never seen a woman more badass. <coughs> oh, of course. Yes. My parents are gonna die and I get to... Heave ho out of here. Oh, nope. 
Oh wow, gonna save my mother with a sword the same weight as my body. Oh yeah! Whoa! The 100 IQ plays! Oh! Oh damn! Hands! Whoa! These barbarians are like in the circus too. Those spins. Sigurd, take the horse. All right, wait here. Now it's my turn to offer you to the slave. Accept your fate. Die a coward here before your people, and I will spare the rest. Fight, my love. Do not listen. Oh my god, they do die. Of course. I give my life. Every single I game. My you have my word. No. No, Fairy. No, Aaron. Pick up your axe. <laughs> <laughs> No. Oh. Oh man. That already makes me angry. <clears throat> I knew it was going to be one of those games tugs at your hard strings. Oh, and there goes my other friend. Oh, and I'm gone. Oh, the horse is down. Yep. Oh, come on, little bro. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. Oh, yeah. Now that's some stuff right there. This is where you play as a happened, guy or around. girl. You'll have to pick a stream to keep things stable. There's a third option too. I can let the animus modulate your identity based on signal strength. It's up to you. Let the animus choose. Well, I mean, I was literally playing as a boy, so it kind of makes sense to play as a male. I mean, in my opinion. All right, I'll lock it in and push ahead to a time where these streams are more synchronized. <sighs> How long have you been chasing me, Wolf Kissed? Seventeen winters? Eighteen? Do I now haunt your dreams? Do I warm your loins? <laughs> You remember this? Oh, your father's axe. The weapon of a coward. A scorn snake. Ah, few things would please me more than to kill with this blade. But I know you would defy me to the death, fighting for a glorious end. That I will not allow. You will live your final days enthralled as a slave. 
humiliated. Oh, this is the same dude Your that death will be killed my one. dad. <laughs> Kill the rest of his crew. Oh, the cruel. Hey, the wolf kissed is no more. That name is dead to this world. The cruel is just. That's an understatement at you this point. You will be worth your weight in silver. Uh, to the ship. Uh. Oh great, am I a slave now? Already? What a life he's lived. You move. And I take your eyes, you hear me? Wind's blowing from the south. We can tack north, then cut west. Now what did I just tell you? Oh, yes. That is the stuff. Ooh, hit him with the assassin. Oh! Oh, he is dead, dead. Cut, I will skin you alive. You will never, never leave this. No feast for you, Sunan. My crew is in danger. You must be my eyes. Oh, yes. Oh. My crew is in danger. Whoa. I need to reach them. Okay. Okay, so RT is to attack RB. Oh. Alright, what's in here? Better. Oh. There's the healing. Ooh, got a bow. What? What is that? <laughs> um. Okay. And half of my gameplay is gonna be me looting. Oh, I'm gonna be so rich. Synchronization. And then rescue my crew from imminent death. <clears throat> Aha! Holy moly. Damn, I really got the stamina. Ooh, what a beautiful view. Lovely. Alright, where's the haystack? Or do I jump into this lake? You know what, we're gonna... Just... Um... Full send? Nope. Uh, what do I do? Do I have to climb down? Oh, yes! Please don't kill me. Okay. Lit! Oh, yes! Tactical skipping. Okay. Oh. Oh, yes. Yes. Thank you. It's getting murderous up in here. <clears throat> oh, damn, I got some strength. It's that berserker blood. Tactical rolls. Tactical skipping. Boom. And whatever this does. Uh oh. Just need to place my shots. 
Yeah. Oh, that's an instant kill. I don't know if I should be getting him out of sight, but I guess that's what we're doing. Damn, I laid his ass out. Nothing like running through the snow with just a shirt. I'd probably be freezing at this point. More boxes. Ooh, a chest this time. You, you bat. Ooh, materials I currently have no use for. Uh, what? I mean, it's, he told me to stay out of sight, but it's also telling me to aim. Why do you have to move? Oh my god, I missed. Boom. Boom, headshot. No cap. And that's how it's done. Okay, now I'm confused. There's a yellow dot, a question mark, and a viking ship. Okay, let's figure this out. Okay, no idea what the yellow means. Alright. A clash of iron. There's fighting nearby. Ooh. Whoa. Thank you, old hound. You live. I do. Slipped away in the sword clash. And what of you? Kyotwe tried to sell me off. A mistake he will regret. Not today, he won't. I saw him board a ship at Aval's Nest not long ago. Sailed east, leaving our crew behind. There must still be time to save our men. I will find them. You ready the longship? You glory hound. You would take the rescue for yourself, so the victory song is written about you. I could storm the beach then, slay two dozen men, seize our dragon boat, and hoist the sail in triumph. Up to you. No, no, I will take the beach. A far more dangerous path. You search the longhouse for our crew. Oh, and here. This corpse will not have need of it. Go. I will meet you by the ship. Yay! I think I have a shield now. That I never saw him give to me. Wait, do I? Oh, I do! Where is it, though? Oh. get that shield or wait a second axe oh no okay we're gonna do that all right what okay okay I see I think that's maybe a bash or counter? I don't know. Oh, this is gonna be sick. Okay. Loot. Oh, is there no way into this house? Okay, it's just a blanket. Gotta make sure I'm getting everything. Every single box. Not even in it for the loot. Box killing simulator. Cute this warriors crawl through Arvel's nest like lice. If I use the main gate, I may attract attention. I should be cautious around here. 
Okay, so don't use main gate. Ooh, ooh. You know it. Show me. Um. So that is gold. I'm assuming I want whatever... Ooh. Well, isn't that fantastic? That, I guess we've found out what the gold symbol means. Question is, how do I get around him? Oh, perfect. Side door. Obviously. I feel like I'm gonna be met with... Okay. And he gone. Go. That. Zunin. Oh, what are these? Ooh, a torch. Oh, goodness. The other side was you must be kidding me. Uh, of course, because that makes sense. You bar up the doors, but leave the window completely open. Ooh. So do I just, do I just hit it? Perfect. Lovely. I'm assuming... There should be an opening in the room. I want the gold first. I don't care about my actual team or anything. I want the loot. Teammates come second. Ooh, there's like a little sprint crouch that you can do. All right, yes! Yes! All the ore. Holy smokes. That's like seven people. Wait, what is it? Yep, that, I think, six or seven. You said there might be an opening from the ceiling. So I'm gonna take his word for it. Haha, -ha! that was good taking his word. Lovely. All right. You squirm like that, and my axe will miss your neck. Unpleasant for both of us. If I'm to die, I want to make a mess of it, Bakraut. Can I like just jump on him? Can I just just spring on him? Just like you know. Just wait. Wait a second. Oh. Oh, okay. So I'm just blind. It's just me. Hopefully I'm not making too much noise up here. Just see my little feetsies dangling. How do I... Oh, there we go. Okay, that was a lot of noise. Stick an axe in my hand. I owe you nothing, Raven shit. Yours is a clan of thralls. And yeah, peasants. okay, Mr. Reeky Wolf. You lay that axe aside or die by mine. 
You should be on a slave ship to Ireland, Wolfkist. I thought that name was dead, mate. But if you wish to be my first sacrifice, <laughs> oh. will be more than oh. happy to receive you. You just killed yourself, Erki. Big man. Oh, let's get it on. Okay, okay. Oh, dodge. That's what that does. <coughs> oh, what a dude. Add a stam. Goodness. Can I just like... light him up uh oh uh oh Ooh. Ooh. Mm, you thought Ooh, okay uh oh that was not good oh yeah Holy shit. Whoa! Oh. Oh, man. Man stood no chance. Father, you should have held on to this until the bitter end. If I give my life, will you spare my clan? Let it no! Pick up your axe! Kill them all! No! Wait, what? What is going on? Oh. Oh, damn, okay. All right. Are you bewitched? Unbind us! What? Oh, yes, of course. All right. Free my brothers! Uh, oh, holy. There are a lot of you in here. Even if your wits were somewhat rattled. Listen here. If you can breathe, you can fight. Now come, we take back our ship. You do not need to tell us twice. Ooh. Let's get that armor on. Like a proper gent. Like a proper gent. All right. Bloody hell. Ooh. Damn, this is some real medieval viking drip holy moly <laughs> oh yeah dual axe let's get it oh this is sick oh okay oh those are some moves Oh. Oh, jeez. Calm down, bucko. Oh, yeah.
Holy! Oh my god. I'm not doing too hot. Ooh, there goes your arm. Gee, just do that forever. Who are we fighting now? Try not to. <clears throat> yeah! Just grind you up. Oh, oh, that's. Nope. Never mind. That's way too far away. How many people we gotta fight? Uh, rep. Absolute rep. I don't think there's anything left here, so I'm just gonna head out. With my mini army, of course. <laughs> or leave all of them behind because I run faster okay boom okay come on <laughs> that works every time the windmill attack what does this do what happens when I press the button come on come here Oh, rip. Everybody meeting their wits end up in here. Oh. <laughs> yep. Yeah, buddy. Oh. Not on my watch. Pick up that loot, though. Come on. <clears throat> totally just jacked his kill. No cap. Who's the last suit? There he is. <laughs> oh my god. Oh. Jesus. Just. Oh, decapitated him. Yeah! Yeah! Ah, oh, what a badass moment. Just jacked half of their towns or villages. Coinage. And I'm about to cast off. Alright, take command. Run up, Ooh, some black flag type stuff going on. Let's get some medieval tunes going. Anything to say for the mess you led us to? We suffered no losses in this fight, and the men who humiliated us are dead. What is there to say? Oh, something like, I was stupid, selfish, reckless, blind, boneheaded, and I smell like blood and shit. I like my <laughs> Wow. Just right out of the gate. No shame. Eivor, look. Someone is setting up an outpost on that island. Shut his men. Gnawing at any piece of open land like dogs worrying your bone. Even with you half in the grave, we could easily take them. I bet. Uh, 
I guess we're hitting it then. Start of the game, and we're already raiding. Oh, yeah! Oh, goodness. No, I'll let him get up. Come on, get up then. <laughs> wow. See now. Aha! Whoa, bone biter. Uh, yeah. Ooh, ooh, yeah. <laughs> oh, ironic, isn't it? No great strength. <laughs> okay, okay. And there goes your land. Let me, let me just, uh, <laughs> let me just, uh, test out this new axe right quick. Whoo, yeah, let's, let's, let's do that. Let's do that right quick. Let me just hop on down. Okay, it's go time. Holy, that's a big Oh my god. What? Oh, he's dead dead. Oh, dead dead. Okay. Okay. Yeah, that what what just happened? Oh my goodness. Okay, so this was a this was a two-handed weapon. Oh my god. Okay, well, uh, there's the strength. What is this? Okay. Cloak. For when it gets chilly, I see. What does the horn do? Am I just... Oh, okay, I guess some are staying. They've made their new home. Oh, never mind. Okay. Giltve will come for us now, harder and stronger than before. No surprise there. This war has spun on for three generations. I hardly expect him to relent. Your hatred for that man burns bright, wolf kissed. I could warm my balls on it! Would you not prefer a pair of sealskin breeches? Just take care, Eivor! Such hatred can make you careless. What he did to your father, he did to all of us. You are not in this fight alone. scold you for setting out against his wishes. Of course you will. Is that not something you worry over? I worry only that our king will not see that I'm right. I'm about an hour into this game and... What would he say? If Sigurd were here, he would be sitting beside... Hey, I quite enjoy it. I think the gameplay runs smoothly. It's, um, quite an enjoyable game. As far as I've experienced, the rating mechanic is actually quite neat. I mean, obviously, I'm hoping that maybe in later gameplay. Will you mention the part where you lost your crew and were nearly sold as a troll? Will that be part of your saga? If there is a skull to dare sing that verse, it will be his last song. I'm hoping that in later gameplay, it can... Um, the rating will expand maybe to a couple a couple different ships hey cut it out 
maybe even bigger ships? Well, well, the feeder of ravens returns, and not half dead. We thought we had lost you, Eivor, for good this time. A warm welcome as always, Randri. You look like red and shit. What happened? Nothing to crow about, except to say the men who delayed us are dead. And how are you? Well enough, though I have spent many tiresome days calming the rages of our king. He is not happy with you. I expected as much. And what of Sigurd? Has he returned from his raids? My husband should be home today. The last we heard, he was approaching Stavanger. Good to hear. We have need of his courage. Sigurd will not save you from his father's wrath, Eivor. You should know that by now. Did your raid not go as planned? They rarely go as planned. But we killed many of Kyoto's warriors. And there was this. My father's axe among the dead. Ah. After so many years. You should take it to Gunnar. He will give it back its edge. A good idea. After I see our king. That I do not advise. Not yet. He is meeting with a messenger from the north. I can wait. A cloud hangs over you. Is something wrong? Seeing my father's axe after 17 winters, it stirred something in me. A feeling I have not had since the day he was killed. Since the day I got this. Memories of past agonies, of sadness and pain. I should speak with Valka. You could help me make sense of my feelings. Take your time getting settled. I will see you at the Longhouse. I think you have lost your edge, Eivor. Just like that axe. Maybe Gunnar can help you with both. I will let you know. Oh wow, okay. You just had to flex on me right quick with uh, the weapons. Okay. Hold up, child. I level up. <sighs> Choose my path. Okay. <clears throat> Melee. Range. And stealth. Well, I've been experiencing a whole lot of melee lately, so. I'm gonna put a few points into here. Just stop on their face. Oh my god. The thing I'm wondering is this is an Assassin's Creed game, and I have yet to see a hidden blade. You bring us any treasure. I returned with a boat and a full crew. That is worth more than silver. That doesn't count. You need silver and jewels. <laughs> Shut up, bro. How do you know? Oh my god. No. Hello, Eivor. Can I just snipe this kid? Uh well, look who it is. Elvis. Practicing your wordplay, Elvis. Ah, Eivor. <laughs> the only mouth in Midgard from which I fear mockery. You taught me the art of writing poetry, old friend. It is only natural that I surpass you soon. How about another lesson then? A quick flight. Right here, right now. What do you say? A word battle? Let's oh try fighting. My. Okay. I always put a few coins down as a wager. Most of those who enjoy flighting have an equal fondness for betting. But today, we'll abstain. Let me begin. I'm ready. In flighting, it's key to match cadence and rhyme. It's as much about sound as it is about time. So be careful in choosing the words that you say. I'll recall what you taught ere I enter the fray. A fine answer. Oh, booyah! And a lovely cadence to match my line. Now, let us examine meaning. <clears throat> 
In flighting, you'll need to be cutting and keen. It's about wielding wit more than venting your spleen. If I tell you you're foolish and stupid and dull... Oh my god. Then I'll tell you you've nothing inside of your skull. Eh, a good response. I called you stupid and you turned it around. Flighting about wit, you matched my meaning. When you think of too many perfect retorts, use the one that best matches the meaning. Last one. So go then and conquer the world with your wit. Go be clever, be quick, show your spirit and grit. I look eagerly forward to seeing how you fare. I will fly to you with flourish and best you with flair. Perfect, yes! <laughs> you could destroy me with such a line. Your flighting's astounding, you're worthy of praise. You swing a fine axe and you turn a good phrase. Thank you, Alvis. I'll take the lesson to heart. I don't know if it's just me, but... Uh... My rap battle skills are on fleek. And side note, that guy kind of creeps me out. His face just it makes me a little, 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 little creepy. A little creepy to me. Wolf kissed. Welcome back. Gunnar, I have something here you might like to see. Thunderclap of Thor! Is that your father's axe? I have not seen this beauty since, well, for some time. I forged this weapon long ago. Still looks good. One of my finest, I think. It has a blunted blade, but it swings well. Can you sharpen it? I can give it a better edge and reinforce the handle. And as luck would have it, I have one ingot left for the job. Are you sure? The fates have will it so. But in future, bring your own metal ingots. I cannot forge them from empty air. Oh, okay. Oh. Yeah. Now that is what I'm talking about. Whoa, now that is <laughs> Pimp my axe <laughs> Viking edition Pimp my axe, let's get it That should do it Anything else? Wow, okay, how are you how doing? Are you gonna... Holding up? Yeah, work is good, and my spirits are. Sp I had. Sorry okay. to hear it. Okay, I'm. I'm already. Five weeks it was. Five beautiful. No, I'm. I don't. No, I don't care about your wife. Okay, That's I'm. I'm done. Me. I'll. Okay. No. Bye bye. I'm good, fam. Miss me with that. Miss me with that. I'm good. Tactical roll. Ooh. Uh, excuse me. They must be finished now. If you have any other business, it may be wise to do it now. Let him cool down. I could speak to Volker first. Get this weight off my mind. The king is not going anywhere. Bruh. Holy moly. Hold the chain parkour? Yeah. Now that is some real parkour. Before it was even invented. Hi. Oh my god, a chicken. Point me to some good hunting oh. hunts? I could. It's a but rooster. I don't, want every iron foot with a bow I, I don't even know game. anymore. Bre Swain. Have you designed any new tattoos? A few worth looking at. 
Let me have a look. Go ahead. Whoa. Oh, that is nakedness. I mean, at least I'm jacked, though. That's all that matters. I don't plan on being shirtless anytime soon, so. Ooh, that's cool, though. Your mangadar. Your mangander. That's the word. More Jormungandr! Holy moly. Ooh. Ooh. You. Jeez. Yeah, he looks cooler with a beard. Exotic. Original. Classic? Classic and original. What? They're, that, mean, that means like the same thing. <laughs> what? Okay, well, I'm just gonna stick with classic. I mean, that is, that is cool. But, I'm gonna just go with Jormungandr, yes. All right, there we go. Oh, wow, that, <laughs> can't see any of it. God, okay, yep, that's what's going on. Oh, that is sick, okay. You can't even see it, but it doesn't matter. Nah, don't need it. Ooh. Uh, take it off. Yeah, no, I'm good. Good. Need anything else? Nope. See you later, you. Sven. Sure. Oh, what? I had a raven tattoo to begin with. Damn. Parkour. <coughs> Tactical roll. Hey, Tekla, what is brewing? Alvis tells me this brew is too strong. Think you can handle a few of Oh, 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 oh yeah. Drinking? Oh, let's get it. Ooh. Ooh. Yup. Oh my god, it keeps getting quicker. I got this in the bag. Oh, yep. Oh, I already got one, mate. Yeah. Oh, what? Whoa, okay. Okay. Oh no! Oh god, okay. Guess I'm not that good at drinking as I thought! Oh! Oh my god, the multitasking is not on fleek today. Come on! Yep! Yeah. No! Oh, oh yes! Yes! The best. Oh great. That was well drunk. Well done. Well drunk done. Oh my god. Come and drink. Let us amuse the gods. Bruh, not again. That was just embarrassing. Yeah, buddy. Ooh, so archery. Trading a needle for an arrow, I see. Eivor, can you teach me the art of archery? That would be happy. <laughs> As I'm drunk. Okay. Let's get it. Uh see how I'm standing. Plant your feet in the ground. No wider than your shoulders. Totally not drunk. Not drunk at all. Back. This is exactly how you do it. You want to hit. Have the Don't accuracy the of a god. Passing straight through it. Loud. Anything more? Ooh. Holy moly, that's a lot of targets. Thank you, Eivor. Now, I have something for you. Hold on! Wait! Yeah. Boom. Dunzo. Alright. Yeah, right. 
nothing left to do except for going in that big garage. Look like you know a thing or two about Daleks. Like you know or two. Orlok, a game of skill, Orlok. <laughs> How about the game? How about the game? Let us okay. play. All right then. Let us begin. Let us begin. Throw the dice and we will play. Whoa. Okay. Kind of briefly heads. Uh, okay. Great start. Um, okay, I think that's good. This game is very peaceful. But the sound effects make it seem like I'm in an actual battle. Lovely. One steal, one protect, and one fight. Okay. Oh, I can just... Oh, full to the wall. Let's get it. Uh... Oh my god, I thought this game was gonna take a while, but I'm already down three stones. <clears throat> That's a, a lot that's a lot of attacking going on. Oh my god. Maybe not so much. It's gonna be very close. I don't know what's gonna happen, but... I think it'll turn out well. Oh, we're dead. You win. Tough luck. Try again. Ah, uh, okay. Yup. Yeah, buddy. Ah, you just got lucky. Another round. Nope. Take this Another L. Time, perhaps. Take this L. Ooh. Okay. Okay, that makes so much more sense. Okay, either I have to climb these mountains or I go by, okay, no, maybe, <laughs> maybe I gotta climb the mountains. Oh boy, ooh, but there's a synchronization point that I need. So looks like we're going for a little winter hike. All right, ooh hoo hoo. Yeah, whoa, what? <laughs> okay. Uh, no, I went down. There we go. Okay. Let's figure out a way up there. I am putting this horse through tremendous pain. Basically having him climb a 90 degree angle. Oh my god. I feel like it'd be faster if I just went on foot. Eh, okay. Oh, yeah. There we go.
Okay, now I need to find a way down. Lovely. Wake up, or you will be cast into the wild. <laughs> Must stay awake. They could be anywhere. Is he walking in his sleep? <laughs> what? They are everywhere. If we die... Everyone dies. This man. How can you s be asleep? Ivan, wake up! You're headed for the edge. Oh, what? We gotta see this. Is he going to ride the rope slide? What? <laughs> ah, I think he's awake now. Well, let's, let's let's join him. Ivan, Ivan, calm down. You are asleep. No, I was flying through the air. <laughs> In your sleep, a harsh awakening. True, but at least you live. Have you always taken these dream walks? Since my posting here. When I am in bed, I worry about ways we could be attacked. When I'm on watch, I cannot stay awake. Only a fool stays awake all night worrying. You're tired when you get up, and the problem is still not solved. You speak with the wisdom of Odin, Eivor. I will think on these words when I am in bed. Consider them on your watch, and sleep when you're in bed. But now, report back before you're labeled a deserter. Go. That is insane. Wow. Mans was just asleep and he's doing some serious Viking parkour. Oh my gosh. Where is the door? I'm having trouble with entrances in this game. They need to seriously work on map design because I can't even find my way to the door. And that's a problem. Hamuram. Hamuram. Valka? Hush. I need silence to hear the songs of nature. Hamuram. Hamuram. Svala. She gives praises and she is greeted. For your hearing, I hearken. O oh, ancient ones, great Odin. Great Freya, I give you thanks for your gift of Seder. She gives thanks and she is blessed. Eivor, it has been some time. What brings you so far to see me? I... I have come for your advice. On a private matter. Come. Is your mother well? Her mind is a jumble. She speaks to spirits. I fear her final winter has come, but she has me. Now, let her speak to your needs. I have had a vision, a powerful vision. It may have been my battle lust or a delirium caused by the cold, but... Describe it for me. After 17 years, I saw my father's axe again. And when I touched it, the vision came on fast. There was a wolf howling in fears. And then a figure, a gray beard in a cloak with a single eye. He bid me follow him. Ah, the high one. He calls to you. Perhaps he means to speak with you, deliver a message. 
Only through Seder will you see more clearly and unravel the threats that sit tangled upon your mind. This will not take long. Have you used this sort of magic before? I have no fear. It was not my satyr that made her like this. Her condition inspired the elixir. Did it help her? For a time, it opened her up to visions. Strange, unreadable things. Then she returned to her current state. Drink. Ooh, what? This potion, I have no idea what it's made of. You know what? We're just gonna full send. <laughs> That's not the powers kicking in. That's me literally dying. <laughs> and that's the trick. I have these hallucinations in my dreams, and she just resuscitates me. It was all a ruse. Oh, not even hallucinations. Just straight pain. Oh, okay, maybe there are hallucinations. Okay. I saw nothing, Balka. Felt nothing. Javi! Javi! Oh, I, that's my mother. A wolf! Sigurd. Brother, when did you arrive? What is this? Oh. Is this some kind of witchcraft summer summoning? What is going on? Because that is physically possible for these candles to be a lit during this heavy wind because that's just logic magical candles that's what they are magical candles yes ah uh, assassin's creed valhalla What? Why does he have no hands? What is what has happened? This was not for you, Javi. <laughs> Man got snatched. Whoa. By a Gigantic wolf. Okay. <laughs> Holy moly. It is Valka. I am here. Gods, I thought I... What was that? Tell me everything. I, I, I was on a mountain in a, in a violent blizzard, climbing toward the summit. Following a, a wolf. Mm -hmm. I saw Odin and the Nornir spinning the threads of fate. They were watching me. 
Mm, not watching. They were showing you the way forward. Your life, your path, what lies before you, and where it ends. And the wolf was eager for my attention, as if it were beckoning me to follow. You are the wolf kissed, fated to carry its mark for life. In this case, it might represent your ambition or your fear. I saw the gates to Odin's Hall of Slain Champions. They opened for me. Shades of Valhalla, for which you are destined. I do not know what else to say. M my memories are faint, hazy. Did you reach the summit of this mountain? I did, yes. Sigurd was there, wounded, in pain. His fighting arm was missing. Then the wolf reappeared. The size of a dragon, twisted and terrible. It fixed its eyes on me and struck. Then I awoke. The gods favor you, Eivor. They always have. You will have your glory, and you will earn your place in Valhalla. But these portents carry a darker truth. The missing arm, the trail of blood, the beast. You will betray your brother, Sigurd. That is the meaning of your vision. Wait, what? I, right. I would never betray Sigurd. He's my brother, my family. The Nordnir have spoken, and this is their message. No, this is wrong. Oh, you misunderstand. That cannot be right. You will betray Sigurd. <laughs> Odin fought against his fate. It can be you have no choice. You will betray your brother. No choice. You drink this magic potion. And now you are forced to do what you do not want to do most. Oh my god. English. English. Okay. Ah! Jeez. Ooh. Let's do some hunting. Oh, yes. I hate killing animals, but, you know, gotta hit him with that fat loot right quick. Just loot, loot a moose. Loot moose. Whoa, what was that? I heard a noise. Ha ha. Holy. Holy moly, these things are quick. They must be finished now. The king has called for his best mead, so the talks are concluded. It should be safe to enter. I'm ready to face the thunder. I will speak with the king now. Excellent, King Stierbjorn. I will take this proposal to my nephew. I believe he will see the wisdom in it. Good. It is all I can hope for. May the... May the winds favor your voyage, Guthormer. Eivor, come forward and explain in plain words why you have willfully disobeyed my commands. Do you mock me? I do not mock you, King. I mean to embolden you against your enemies and your own poor judgment. You know nothing of my judgment. You know nothing of my plans and strategies. Sigurd would agree with me. My son might agree with you, but he would obey me. He knows his place. Not as well as he knows his father. Imagine you are harassed by an enemy with warriors that vastly outnumber your own. What profit does open war bring? Would it not be better to work quietly through diplomacy, gaining alliances? Waiting until the day our numbers outweigh our enemies and our victory is guaranteed. Do we have any allies to speak of? Or is that your excuse to do nothing? Your confidence blinds you to so much in plain sight, Eivor. 
Day and night I toil to forge ties with clans to the north. Very soon you will see the fruits of my efforts. Only then will you understand. Is that all? I'm at a loss with you, Eivor. When I took you in as my own, never did I imagine such disrespect from the child of Varin. Your father was a fine man. Just and loyal to me, he died bravely so that we might live. He died a coward, Lord. A fate I will not mirror. Why do you carry such a useless burden? Let it go! Think only of the days to come, of your future and the victories at hand. My honor has been stained. Until it's wiped clean, I want nothing else. I refuse to pick at that wound again. But if there is something that can chase these shadows from your thoughts... Sigurd has come! Down at the docks, his ship is here! Ooh. <clears throat> that is my brother, I'm pretty sure. Uh, all right. Hey, hey, careful with that one. Hey, bud. Is he good? <laughs> oh, look at you, blood-soaked drinker. What have you been worrying with them? Oh, and you. Cured by Kinga. I smell the stink of a dozen kingdoms in your beard. It's <laughs> just the start. Randvi, my dear wife, your husband returns, bringing gifts and riches to share. And new friends, I see. Yes, Basim and Hytham. We met in Miklagan. Oh. They showed me her buried secrets. Oh. We are grateful to Sigurd for his invitation. The assassins. Eager to pay tribute to your king. My brother is always very careful with the company he keeps. If you're standing safely beside him, he must like you. Ah, Eivor. Save the introductions until our bellies are full. I will see my father. Tell him of my time away. This morning we traded with a ship passing south. They told us Eivor the Wolf Kist was captured by Kyrtvis men. They must have cut the tale short. I killed my captors and recovered my crew. And for that your father scolded me. You know where I stand, brother. Nothing short of war will dislodge Kyrtvis from our lands. But he disagrees. I know. I know. Father thinks too much and acts too little. Today that changes. I promise you. By the winter's end, the name Kurt with the crew will be a curse on the lips of a drunken fool. My son, welcome home. Uh, father. Tonight we feast and celebrate your return, Sigurd. The tables are laid with barley and lamb, bread and mead. And no more, I beg you. I want nothing you would not serve a thrall. Let me be the one to honor you. I bring gifts and tales from faraway lands. After two winters away, I am full up with both. Very well, very well. Come inside. And when we are fat and satisfied, father, we will talk of Kyrtve and his clan, and how we may end their terror. Once and for all, he has dogged us too long, shamed us for too many seasons. I know this. Eivor knows this. It ends now. Yes, of course, when the time is right. <laughs> Through Rusland we barreled down the Volga River, raiding as we went, shadowy tribes hurling spears at our ship. At Miklagard, we saw men bedecked in riches as vibrant as the Biverest itself. And these we took for our troubles, of course. We sailed to Rome, then Africa, past oceans of sand, warriors of all colors, and beauty the eyes must weep to behold. And now I have returned, 
with riches and glory to share with my family, my friends, my eyes for Strengir. So take what you desire from my horn. For this, this is only a taste of things to come. Tomorrow, the Raven Clan starts anew. Skull, Sigurd. Skull! And you, Eivor, come. I have something special for you. All right. Randvi. Eivor, have you paid a visit to Valka? I did. And? It is... Not... I understand. Your bed will be warm tonight, but your husband returned. That must be a good feeling. It is a different feeling. Warmer, but with less space to stretch my arms and legs. Are you not happy to see your husband return? Why is she so stanced up? Like so she's long, ready to hit me. To me. Three winters we are married, and he has been away for two. Can you not rekindle the flame that once burned hot? <laughs> when he crawls into bed to warm me, as you say, it will be with farts and honeyed breath. Ah, uh, we should all be so lucky. <laughs> That's how a relationship should be. Uh, ooh, the assassin. Python, is it? Yes, and you are Eivor. I am. I hope this ruckus does not overwhelm you. We tend to drink and talk at equal speed. Not at all. The wood smoke from your fire pit does sting the eyes, but the warmth is welcome. Of course. It must be rather warm where you live. Where I live changes from week to week, but always I am with my mentor, Basim. A mentor? For what cause? A noble one. A cause as true as the world is old. But let us leave it at that for now. I understand. <laughs> it's weird. To stay tight lipped for the rest of the night. This, um, keep clear of Tekla's meat. The armor uh, somewhat resembles Altair's armor from the first game. From the first ever Assassin's Creed. Like the belt? I mean, it is around his time period, I'm pretty sure. You have a good memory. And you have no meat. Can I fix that? Sigurd spoke often of you on our journey. Called you his right arm. A celebrated warrior. I am honored to meet you. Likewise, Basim. And how did you come to meet my brother? He sat down in Constantinople some months ago to rest and resupply, he told me. But I knew otherwise. Men with eyes that gleam like his are always up to something more. I think he wished to raid the Hajj of Sophia. That sounds right. I will not bore you with the details of our meeting, but I liked your brother from the first. I saw something in him that captivated me, as if a forgotten memory of an old friendship had suddenly resurfaced. He has that effect on people. Enjoy your evening, Basil. <laughs> there are others to speak with. Sigurd has raised the reputation of this clan to new heights, Lord. We could not have asked for a more joyous return. Oh, but we could have. Had Sigurd spent his last two winters here, in Fornberg, defending our lands, we might have been rid of Kjotve by now. You always said we needed more warriors to fight Kjotve. And for warriors, we need wealth, which Sigurd has brought us. The wealth he brings will not buy us an army. It only buys us time before our end. You talk like a man with one foot in Helheim. Have you no plan of your own to rid this land of our enemy? Or will it fall to Sigurd and me? I do, but it will fall to you and Sigurd to accept it. And I must have your word that you will. If you so order it, my king, it will be done. You have my axe until the end. Hmm, we shall see. I thought long and hard on a gift worthy of you. You've snared my curiosity, brother. What is it? Not yet. Drinks first. What? No. Come on. My first night in Fornberg in over two <laughs> That's years. so lame. It must end with me soaked and wall-eyed, shouting at the shadows of trolls. And you want me to sail with you in these honey waves? Yes. You are stuck with me, Dringur. Now drink. <laughs> oh, you would 
put Thor to shame. From drinking to breathing, you turn everything into a competition, brother. I must always be prepared. <laughs> True enough. It is good to have you back, Sigurd. Yes. I've missed this terribly. When I first met Basim, I regaled him with tales of our homeland. And it was then I felt a hard longing to return at once. Come. This I mean, their armor you. is really cool. These excellent men were my shepherds through much of their homeland, the Abbasid Caliphate. They are a clan not joined by blood, but by a common idea. A brotherhood of shadows executing their own form of justice. In my time with them, they shared many of their most hidden secrets, for which I am grateful. And now... I gift one of these secrets. Oh to you. yes. Weapon for the finest warrior I know. Let's get it. Hidden blade. Python is not amused, it seems. Am I not worthy of this gift? It is not about worth, Eivor. It is a matter of devotion to our creed and and training. Please. <laughs> Mentor, I must protest. This is deeply unorthodox. Our wrist blade is a sacred Do tool. Do not make a fetish out of cold metal, Haifa. What matters is the mind of the one who wields it. Please, try it on. The blade should ride on the underside of your arm to conceal it from your target. I have no wish to hide this. And I would rather not make the same mistake you two have. I like it. This is no mistake. This is a voluntary sacrifice to prove our devotion to... A good start, Eivor. But you must learn how to use it effectively. Outside. This is not something for all eyes. Lead on. So, not to get a little nerdy, but um, the lore behind the um, missing finger is that's what they had to do back way when before Assassin's Creed 2, to which Leonardo da Vinci fixed that and changed it so you didn't have to lose your ring finger when wielding the hidden blade. And, yeah. I look forward to it. I mean, I find it pretty neat that they added in that little key detail. Since it was before Leonardo's time and Assassin's Creed 2. Which was in, like, 14th century? Uh, 15th? I don't know. Assassin's Creed 2 was definitely in a time period way ahead of this. Excellent. I have not seen a blade so sharp. Some targets are trickier than others. Keep that in mind before you strike. Oh. A decent attempt. Take that one down from the ledge. <laughs> okay, retry. Oh my god. Exactly, just like that. How about a challenge? Leap down upon that target from above. Oh, trademark sound. Now I'm hot and bothered. Use your surroundings when possible. Oh, from that haystack for yes. Haystack a kill. Strike. From behind. Mentor, All right. Join us? Not that I am aware. 
Why offer him the blade? Surely we have more. Hush. I want to be an assassin. You wield the blade well. Let us leave Eivor to enjoy his gift in peace. Come. Eivor, let us walk to the docks and take in the night air. What do you make of my new friends? They seem generous and menacing in equal measure. I know what you mean. And they have learning, too. They wield numbers and writing as if it were magic. Basim has shown me so much about the world, all of which I will share with you when the time is right. Oh, I miss the smell of this land. Have you returned for good? Or do you mean to join this Shadow Brotherhood? Leave all that aside, Ivor. Tonight we are family again. The here and now is what matters. Our kinship. Our clan. Our glory. I missed you, brother. Your clear head and your courage. We have not had enough of both in recent months. <laughs> you flatter me, wolf -kissed. Keep it up. From here to Valhalla, I will always be on your side, Sigurd. Always. This fjord has grown too small to contain me. Or I too large. There is so much more beyond these stony fangs that rise around us. England, Ireland, Francia, all greener pastures, ripe for the plucking. Tomorrow, we make new war on Kyrte, and reclaim the lands he took from us. And from there, we build a kingdom for us. I'm with you. Only say the word. Good. Get some rest, and return here at first light. The Nordnir have spoken. You will betray Sigurd. No! This is wrong! That cannot be right! Ah! Odin fought against his fate! It can be done! Ah! You will betray Sigurd. Shit! Kjotve's warriors! All right, I think that's where we're going to leave it off for today. Um, leave it on a bit of a cliffhanger. So <laughs> if you enjoyed the video, please like. And if you're feeling generous, possibly give me a subscribe.